the Atari 2600. It was the very first gaming console I ever played. And yet, somehow, it was a gaming console that had always bested me in one way or another. Though mind you, it was mainly due to my lack of gamer skill at the time, for I was indeed rather young and did not comprehend in the vastness of gaming. Still, I dared to play it even though it bested me so many times. I played it until the time of the N64 when I abandoned it in the hopes of increasing my gaming skills. Now, 15 years later, I return to the gaming council that beat me in the hopes of beating it. Hello everyone, Pokemon 9 for you, and let's begin Super Breakout. Okay, I actually found that I'm not that bad at this game. At least not as bad as I am at, at the regular Breakout. As I understand, this is meant to be an update of sorts to the regular Breakout. I would have a few um, improvements over it, and... Ah, oh, great. And, you know, I pretty much have to agree. The movement it's a lot smoother the I can really tell. And um one thing one person mentioned to me was that the reason why I sucked so much at the original breakout was because of the fact that I used an emulator, but you see, I wish I really wish I could actually um not use one at this point because of the fact that well uh, okay, I do own both of these games, but the thing is, my controller just doesn't work for them. I mean, my controller works for every other game I've got, but not these two. So yeah, I'm kind of forced here, here sadly. Maybe if I pick up a different controller one day, they will actually remove move again. Oh well. Oh boy, and this is not what I like at this point. Hey, oh dear. Once it gets to the blue level, for ack, it really starts to move fast. Okay, let's go through. Ah, oh, man. All right. <clears throat> but yeah, I didn't find myself sucking as much at this as anyways. So not great. Okay, down to my last. One, so let's see if I can make this work out somehow. Whoop. Ah, great. Well, that's it for me. So, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Bye.